can you hear me now? Hello, can you hear me now? Oh, oh, I'm on Christina Hagen Live. I got to go. I got to go. But I think I might have a solution to the problem sitting right next to me. Bye. <laughs> so tell me, um, we're in Silicon Valley, and I'm here with James Johnson, and he's here to try to help solve this problem that I was just entertaining here with you on Christina Hagen Live. Uh, how can we solve this problem? Well, the problem, as you described, is uh, probably the most prolific question in the world. Can you hear me now? And why is that? Most cell phones are two-way radios. They transmit out there. They go out and they make signal connection and, and uh, sometimes they don't always make the best connection. And that is related to the antenna inside the cell phone. Mm. So years ago, as they turned to digital, uh, people with hearing aids started experiencing lots of problems with cell phones and realized that it was the radiated signal from the cell phone antenna going into their hearing aids that was causing all kinds of noise. We might have heard that noise in your stereo sometimes when your cell phone is sitting next to the stereo. Very powerful signals. Mm. We've learned later that when you're using the cell phone at next to your head, half of the energy is absorbed by your head. Now, industry doesn't have a problem with that, but the hard of hearing people had a big problem with that, and they would say, can you hear me now? Now everybody's saying, can you hear me now? Scary. It's the antenna. And the whole thing is about the antenna. So we sought about several years ago to solve the problem for hearing aid users and hard of hearing people. And we were supported by the FCC, the federal government, who ordered the mobile phone industry to come up with better antennas for people. And instead, they kind of went down in cost and lower and lower and lower. And that question, can you hear me now, can up, up, and up. Mm. So. Here we are today, we've decided to launch our technology inside of a cell phone. Uh, when we put this technology, antenna technology, into a cell phone, we remove the radiated signal going to the head. So the signal goes forward and backwards, but it does not go laterally Very into nice. the head. And in doing so, we end up with more energy out of the head, radiated out there, less battery usage, everything improves, clarity wow. and other things. Amazing. And so, as we launch this phone, we plan on launching Earth's first green phone. Yay. <laughs> we need that. Yeah, and so uh, we'll get into where that's going and how it's going to be launched later on with our launch team. Thank you. Okay, great. Thank you, Jim. Thank you. From Vortis Technology Incorporated here in Silicon Valley, you're on Christina Hagen Live.